proud to introduce the creation of a new award, the <coughs> Plumbing Industries Award of Excellence, established by the American Supply Association to recognize achievements specifically related to the plumbing sector of our industry. This award is not an annual award, but is given at the discretion of the Plumbing Division's Executive Council. The recipient is someone who has a record of significant accomplishment and recognition in the PHCP industry with overall influence on the current status of the channel. This individual will have a history of dedicated service to the American Supply Association Plumbing Division and is an active participant in division activities. A person being honored with this award will project a positive industry image and is responsible for positively affecting the industry in general. The Plumbing Division is fortunate to have identified two individuals this year who are most deserving of this honor. I'm pleased to announce the recipients of the first ever Plumbing Industry Award of Excellence, Wally Gum of Embassy Group and Rick Schwartz of Wynn Wholesale. for receiving this award is based not only on the recipient's influence on the current status of the channel, but also for being instrumental in positively affecting the industry in general. Wally Gum has been a pioneer in establishing buying groups as a driving force in the plumbing industry. Many independent wholesalers <laughs> are as strong as they are today because of the success of the various industry buying groups. Over the years, Wally has been instrumental in building strong ties between Embassy Group and ASA. Under Wally's leadership, Embassy was the first of the national buying groups to open their meetings to the association staff and allow them to participate in Embassy's appointment rotation. When asked about Embassy's early leadership of establishing cooperative relationships with ASA, Wally stated, I never felt it should be an us versus them situation. We always recognized that ASA had a different function than Embassy. Our leadership has always been advocate of the benefits of the involvement in ASA, encouraging our members to be part of both organizations. Wally has been a part of the PHCP industry for 25 years, starting out with CO Watt. In 1991, John Vogt approached Wally about starting a new member-owned buying group for the industry. An embassy group was born. Starting out with 13 members and 16 vendors, Wally's leadership raised the profile of the group, making it an essential partner to the independent wholesalers and instrumental to achieving the levels of success that would not have been possible without that partnership. Today, Embassy has 69 members and 95 vendors and is recognized as a premier group in the industry. Longtime Embassy member Don Maloney of Coburn Supply shares, Wally came to Embassy at the onset of the organization. He was the link that solidified the formation of the group. His ability to understand how the manufacturer and wholesaler interacted and their individual desires and requirements bode well for us. He had the confidence of both groups and worked hard to benefit both. He was the best person for the job and he grew as Embassy grew, making many good friends along the way, among which I included myself. From the manufacturer's perspective, John Martin of Anvil International says of Wally, he has an appealing way in a manner about him that can put one immediately at ease under most any circumstance, be it a business issue or a personal need. I've known him now for some 25 or 30 years, and I can't recall one time during those years where he did not get pushy or where he got, did, where he got pushy or demanding in any way. I'm sorry, Wally. I'm sorry, John. Where he, for the need and the success of the business or the group of wholesalers which he was representing. Yet fairness for all people involved in the plumbing industry, including vendors, 
is as much of a concern to him as any issue itself. He believes that everyone deserves a true shot of success in, what, in, in whatever endeavor they pursue, both personally and professionally. So on behalf of the Plumbing Division Executive Council, we are proud to recognize Wally's accomplishment in the PHCP industry, his history and involvement with ASA, and the positive image he has projected these many years. It is my pleasure to present this Industry Award of Excellence to Mr. Wally Gump. Wally Joe must have got a copy of my notes. <laughs> when Mike Gallese contacted me about two months ago and advised me that I was selected as one of the two recipients of this award, I was caught off guard. For a moment, I was even speechless. Because, you know, buying group guys like me usually don't get awards. We most generally get abused. <laughs> In all seriousness, I am honored, I'm humbled, and I'm grateful that the ASA Executive Committee selected me as one of the recipients. If I were to stand here today and name everybody that has had an impact on my life, my career, and any success I had, we'd be here until tomorrow morning. So for those that are in the room, and those that uh, obviously aren't, thank you from the bottom of my heart. My whole business career, which spans 45 years, has been in buying groups. I've been in several industries, agriculture, paint and sundries, hardware, lawn and garden, and for a short stint in animal nutrition. But the last 25 years has been in this great industry. And I'm here to tell you, it's the greatest of them all. This year, Embassy celebrated 21 years in business. I am proud of that, and I'm so proud of that organization as we got it started in 1991. We have 69 distributors and 95 vendors. We have grown over the years because of the support of those organizations. And being associated with organizations like ASA, MCAA, Hardy, and, you know, it's an often used phrase, it's a people business, you can put the business aside, but it's the people that I cherish most in this industry. I've had, gained a lot of friends and relationships, and as I move on, that's what I'm going to miss most, are the people. As for ASA, as Joe said, Embassy has been a strong supporter. 75% of our members are members of ASA, and we continue to encourage the other 25%. There have been several past presidents of ASA from the Embassy membership. We have involved, as you saw up here, ASA in our March conference, which includes all vendors and members, and put them in the rotation along with the vendors so they have an opportunity to meet one-on-one -on -one with every one of our members. We periodically invite them to the August shareholders meeting to address the group on ASA initiatives, government affairs, etc. So ASA has been a strong partner with Embassy, and if you're not involved with ASA, not a member of ASA, I strongly urge you to do so. In closing, I want to again thank the ASA Executive Committee. But I also want to thank the members and vendors who have truly made this possible. But there's one person I want to single out. Has been by my side all 45 years in thick, thin, all the ups and downs, etc. She's been my strongest supporter, and that's my wife, Andrea. Andrea, we just give <laughs> 